Oh my god, I'm so tired. <laughs> One of the chocolate pie balls, um, you can't really tell right now. I think it was that one i'm not sure no it was one of these two but yeah one of those are the second born male and then he's a third born male what do you guys call that because he has like a chocolate dot and then he has like a fawn type of patch and then around it's black i don't know if that's going to be black or blue i know somebody called it like a blue fawn so if it was black, do you call it like a black fawn? I don't know. And it's even like kind of right there. It's like that little line. So I don't know what to call that color. I was thinking it was going to be Merle because of that. But now I'm starting to doubt it. And we got this kid all the way up here. Let's try to squeeze in with them. What kind of puppies are they? They're bully pits. Bully pit bull mix. Pit bull bullies. What breed and how many? Yeah. Um, so yeah, they're bully pits. And there's nine pups. There is six boys and three girls. And two out of those three girls are still available. But all six males are still available. And we have this one over here. Let me go help him. He needs to get over here and stay warm. Come here. Let's kind of squeeze in with them over there. I'm going to go right back over there. Some of them just like their personal space. Let me see. Let me put him with mom. Now he's looking for her. But yeah, some of them just like their personal space. But I know that's not really too good, especially if the room is cold. Not saying this room is cold. It's actually very hot in here. <laughs> I'm literally sweating. Like, that's how hot it is in here. So I'm honestly about to get out this room or turn the heater off for a little bit. That's why I'm going to invest in a heating pad for them. So that they could be on the heating pad. And I don't have to keep this heater on because this heater is way too hot. More dogs when there's already too many. Hey, I mean, accidents happen, you know. We're not robots. So, accidents happen. It's no one's fault in the matter, but things just happen. And trust and believe none of these dogs will be going to any shelters. They'll all be finding good homes. We'll get them fixed. These pups will be getting fixed, actually. All of these pups will be coming with spay and neuter contracts. The only reason she's not fixed is because we already got her while she was pregnant from a neglectful family. So I guess you could say she's actually like, kind of like a rescue in a way. I mean, the family literally, well, not really family, but the guy who lives like a few blocks down. We don't really like talking to him. He's not a nice person. He left her outside in the freezing cold snow to die. Like, literally, he did not care. We tried to bring her back. He said he doesn't want her, so we just took her. So I'm not sure if he bred her. Because when we got her, she was already coming out of heat. Well, not really coming out of heat. She was already pregnant. It just looked like she was coming out of heat. Well, after I get her.